Amerika abana musini wani mwenyamfo Robert Jackson edu bulone afumante muno enu wasu wajidi ye pasa na nimu ntuya wetu edu kwa bulone afumante muno ebe buwa mwiku ya yeju madie akosu wasa na abana ya nafumu diye biya raso ebe buwa maigana wuku ya yemu na bulone afumzo su enu wajidi ye pa ese edu ya ni dosu yonu ejina enti enu wadine ni acho mwa kwa kwa sura mafu ashwe ashwe sadie ni mwemu sitie ni wasu wafo wabu nani afumante muno aku wako di ensa wasu wadi tujua chile se Amerika abana wajisha yebe bri a e ba be bo ama enuane ahodo a bi te se aburo no ye dua ne tutuo pa e wo ga na hase yi eno esa dan chenzo so a enima bebre no na aban na ye na adwe so be sho ga na mu abia ahwa ma na koso bi e ye apomuden ene enwuma sua next year a five year uh, program that was agreed upon with the previous government uh, we are looking at how uh, we can be more responsive to the new government's priorities we will certainly consider uh, how uh, environmental practices and land reclamation uh, can be looked at, improving storage and reducing post-harvest loss. We're also um, working with uh, cashew companies, with cocoa processing companies. Last week in Accra, uh, or week before last, we launched uh, Cargill's new uh, cocoa buying uh, program. We've been working very closely with with all of the companies in the cocoa sector and the cocoa board to ensure that um, the farmers get the best possible prices for their cocoa. We're doing the same in the cashew sector, uh, and we've invested very heavily in cashews, which grow very well in this region. We're also looking at other uh, potential cash crops, but. Uh, uh, we think that in this region, cocoa and, and cashews are have very uh, uh, great potential, greater than has been realized uh, in recent years. <laughs>